Hey everybody, it's Jen. Welcome or welcome back to the channel. I'm bringing you today kind of a mini shopping haul, some pieces that I picked up for my upcoming cruise. I'm gonna show you how I plan on styling them. I'm gonna tell you where I got them and I'm really glad that you're here. This blows my mind, but I am leaving in one week for an eight night trip. I am flying to Rome, then I am boarding a Disney cruise ship and I am sailing to Naples, Mykonos, Santorini, uh, Hania, which is the Isle of Crete, I believe, and then two days at sea. It is going to be an epic adventure. I'm going with a wonderful friend and I'm so excited about the trip, but as I was planning, a couple of things became very obvious. Number one, because of the way the schedule is working out, I wanna do carry-on only for all of the reasons that I've told you guys before I do carry-on only, but also because I'm flying back the day that I get off the cruise ship, which can be a little bit dicey with international travel. So I really didn't wanna to have to mess with checking a bag at the airport in Rome. So I made a firm decision that I was gonna do carry-on only. I do have access to laundry, but nonetheless, for an eight night trip, that's gonna be you know, some thinking. So I picked up a few pieces that will work really, really well together. You guys know how I feel about doing like a Granimals style wardrobe so that everything goes with everything else. These are all the pieces that I'm gonna show you today. Um, let's start with the dress that I'm wearing. Now, this is from an amazing brand that I was actually introduced to by you guys. You all told me when I started talking about merino wool that I had to check out the company wool and and bought um, I've bought now four pieces from them completely fell in love with the company love their mission love their team like I reached out I don't think I've ever had such a delightful interaction with a team of people about getting set up as an affiliate you know how you can just kind of tell when people that work together genuinely like each other I got such good vibes from this company so if you're looking to support a smaller company that makes excellent wool that is all ethically sourced check out wool and you might have heard of them because they've done the 100 day dress challenge a lot of women participated in this over the pandemic so the dress that i'm wearing is from them now let's go back to what i talked about in the other video that i did and i'll put a link to that right here or right here how merino wool works it is naturally antibacterial so it does not smell it's it's like a miracle fabric so you can wear it over and over and over again and not have to wash it it's also great for the environment because it's a fabric that if you care for it and store it properly it will last you potentially for decades so this blue dress is from them i'm going to show you all the different ways that i'm going to be styling this very simple blue dress for my upcoming cruise. Now keep in mind a Disney cruise is generally um, it's not super formal so uh, I don't I'm not taking anything super formal on this trip but I did want to look cute and put together so yeah so we're going to start with this gorgeous dress. Now I am for frame of reference, because it's really hard to tell on video how tall someone is. I'm five foot five and a half. That half is very important to me. I am definitely more pear shaped. Um, I'm tiny around the waist, not tiny. I have a small waist and think very highly of ourselves, don't we? And I have bigger hips and I am broad shouldered. So sometimes I have to size up in brands. Um, I probably could have taken a small on this dress, but the medium, a lot more comfortable, a lot more movement in it. And I love that it has pockets. Also from Woolland, I got this adorable black sleeveless dress. I am so excited about this dress. It has like a surplus um, neckline, which is really, really attractive. I don't have to wear this with like a camisole underneath. I did wear it with a camisole in the picture that I'm going to show you. And the camisole that I picked was from Amazon. And these are very inexpensive and I'm kind of in love with them. I have two more colors of this on the way, um, but they have a built-in shelf bra and they pack up it to basically nothing as far as how much room it will take up in your luggage. So this is a fabulous kind of a basic to have. So I picked those up, really happy with those. But yeah, this dress is just gorgeous and it can be dressed up or dressed down. I could easily wear this with my little Kariuma sneakers 
pictures to go on an excursion. I could also wear it in the evening, especially with a scarf, maybe a little bit of updated jewelry, but what a basic, perfect dress. Absolutely love it. So these two pieces picked up new, could not be happier with either of them. And the links for these will be down in the description box. So next up, I have a few pieces that I picked up from J. Crew. Now, this first item, I know a lot of you are going to be like, Jen, how are you going to pack that without it getting wrinkled? Well, number one, I'm not. Um, this blazer is linen. I fell in love with it. I saw it in my local store. I ended up getting an eight, even though the six definitely fit me, but I wanted it to be a little bit roomier so that I could layer it over, you know, maybe a lightweight sweater or something else. But for cruising in particular, layers are really important. Even though I'm cruising in Greece in the summer, at night out on the deck and in the dining rooms, it can be super, super chilly. So I'm gonna show you different ways that I decided to style this blazer, but I am so in love with it. And for some reason, I did not have a white blazer in my wardrobe. So I just feel like this is something I will get so much use out of. Um, this scarf I showed you guys in my international packing video, it is 100% merino silk, got it off of Amazon, but I absolutely adore it. I love the print. It looks very expensive, even though it wasn't. And you can see how you can style the dress in a way that just makes it look a little bit more elevated. It was not inexpensive, but yeah, I, I'm in love with it. I'm taking it with me on the cruise. I will figure out how to pack it so that it doesn't wrinkle and I'm very excited about it. Okay, the next piece that I purchased that was new is also from J. Crew, and it's this little linen button front dress. I actually have it unbuttoned right now, but I'll show it to you guys on me. Now here's why I love this dress for taking on a cruise. Number one, it's linen, it's light, it's airy, but also it again can be dressed up or dressed down. I can belt it and wear a little bit nicer shoes with it, or I can wear sneakers with it. I can wear it over a bathing suit and it will pack up to basically nothing. Now, if you are a perfectionist, Linen may not be your best friend when it comes to packing because it is going to wrinkle. I don't mind that. I think that's how you know it is 100% real linen. Um, this is actually Irish linen from J. Crew. Their stuff is very, very high quality. Funny story, do you know I actually have a J. Crew sweater hanging in my closet right now that is from 1987 that I still own and still love. So it's a great brand. I went through a little bit of a break with them. They were doing some designs that did not suit me, but the last couple of seasons, they have been knocking it out of the park and I've been thrilled with pretty much everything that they've come out with. So I'll link this dress below. I don't remember what size. Okay, I did get a small in this dress. It was kind of funny because I thought I needed the medium and the sales associate was like, you don't need the medium. You look really cute in the small. I was glad I listened to her. Love, love, love this dress. Picked that up. Okay. Now this next item, I don't think I have ever tried something on that I have been so sure needed to come home with me and be part of my life. Um, and, and just been like, so that is so me, it was meant for me. This blue and white striped pleated skirt, y'all. This skirt, now interestingly, I saw a lot of pleated midi skirts on women in Japan, and I kept thinking, when I get home, I need to find a really cute uh, midi skirt. It has an elastic waist, you can belt it, you can put a scarf as a belt, you don't have to belt it at all, you could wear it with something fitted and a jacket. I'm gonna show you guys how I'm styling it with my denim jacket, with my linen blazer, you can wear it with a t-shirt and sneakers, you could wear it with heels. This skirt is just, perfection. I will say this, if you want this skirt, order it soon. This is one of those pieces that I definitely see selling out. It's back in my, you know, blue and white, which you guys know I adore. And I just, the fabric, it is a cotton poplin. And I think I got a small in this. I can't remember if this one came in sizes or did it come in small, medium, large? small, medium, large, and I did get a small. And it's just the fabric is to die for. So um, yeah, I absolutely love it. I'm so excited to take it with me on my cruise. Okay, then the last piece that I'm gonna show you is my new jean jacket. I don't know if it's still on sale. If it is, run, don't walk to the Vineyard Vines website and buy this jacket. I was in need of a new denim jacket. The denim jacket that you've seen in my other videos, I have had for 
literal decades. And I just, it, it, I wasn't happy with how, it wasn't really comfortable enough as far as it didn't have a lot of movement to it. This one has a little bit of stretch. It is made in Italy. It has the interior pockets like I've talked to you guys about. It's so handy when you're traveling. And since I bought this jacket, I have worn it almost every single day. Because even though I live in a warmer climate, you go into restaurants, it gets chilly, um, the car gets chilly, everywhere we go we need an extra layer and this jacket is just fabulous now a couple of people have told me that on the website it looks a lot lighter than how it reads in you know when they've seen me wear it on Instagram or whatever but if you're looking for a great quality denim jacket um, the maker of this is Vineyard Vines so if they're sold out I would see if maybe you could wait or get on a wait list and see if it becomes available again because I'm telling y'all, this is my new favorite denim jacket that I've ever owned. And that's saying a lot because I always have a great denim jacket in my wardrobe. Okay, so that's it for the clothes that I bought for this trip. I will do a full packing video and I will be showing you guys everything else that I'm taking, the bags that I'm taking, the shoes that I'm taking, um, and it is all going to fit in a carry-on. So if you're not already subscribed, you wanna make sure you do that, hit those bell notifications. And if you like this video, please make sure and hit that thumbs up. That really helps me with the algorithm. And if you really like this video, go ahead and watch one of my other videos. The algorithm loves it when you guys watch another video after watching this one. So thank you so much for being here. Whatever you're doing, I hope you're finding joy and I'll see you next time. Bye.